Lisa, and I'm going to show you how to get Siri today. And I know everybody freaking wants Siri, everybody's crazy about Siri, but everybody's been saying, no, don't download certain things with Siri, because it's going to brick your device, don't do it. I mean, actually, I've done it before, and it did brick my, I mean, it didn't brick it, but you know, it like locked it, it got stuck on the Apple logo for like five freaking hours. And I had to restore it and back to manufacturing settings and restore from backup and you you don't want to do that. So first, I'm going to show you that I actually do have Siri right here. See? Siri? I have her. Her, him. I don't really give a crap what it is. I'm going to go back into general and before you do anything, go into auto lock and press never. Because Siri is going to be a big file to download, and it's going to take at least 10, 5 to 10 minutes. Mine took 10, probably around 10, because I remember it being a really long time. So open up your um, Cydia. Let that suck a load. Loading, loading. Okay. Here we go. Um, if you guys don't know how to get here, it's just manage tab down here. Um, sources. You are going to want to add a source. It's gonna be Cydia. iPhone tweak. Dot fr slash. You're going to want to add that. So after you do, I'm gonna hit cancel because I already have it. It's right here. Um, go into your search and see how I clicked up there. How I searched spite. Some people are saying, no, Spite doesn't work. Well, it actually does now. So, that's what you're going to, that's what you're going to, that's what you're going to want to do. Search Spite. Let this sucker load. And it is Cydia. So, it's going to take a long, well, not a long time, but just a little bit because I have a lot of packages. Alright, for iPad users, you are going to want to download Spite 3.0.1-1 for iPad. And everybody else, um, iPhone 4, iPhone 3GS, iPod Touch 4G, you're going to want to download Spite 3.0.1-1 Untethered. Do not even try to download the iPad or it's going to be locked. And I know you don't want to do that. And I know hopefully you're not stupid enough to do that. I mean, I hope. I don't know. There are some dumb people out in this world. Right here it says can take 15 to 30 to install. Not really. Um, it just takes 5 to 10. Maybe 15 Mine took like 10 minutes, so you're going to want to install that. It is going to take 10 minutes, so you might want to, I don't know, start it, go watch some TV, come back, but make sure your auto lock is on never, so this doesn't, you know, auto lock, or you're going to be screwed, I guess, that's what people say, I mean, I never had it happen to me, and I'm never going to, because I'm not going to be stupid, sit it on that. So once you get that done, um, it might look like it's stuck when it's downloading, but it's not. It's just still downloading. Um, then, after that, it's going to go really fast and it's going to give you this message. Give you this message at the end that's going to say, Do not exit out of it now or it will brick your device. And that will take about like five minutes. It'll... 
it'll look like it's almost done, like it's almost there. And it's going to tell you to don't cancel or it will brick your device. I mean, I believe it, it probably will. So I would just wait it out. Don't touch anything. Don't do anything. I don't know. Just don't be around it because you're going to be prone to like messing it up and then you guys are going to yell at me because I didn't tell you. Once you do that, you're going to go down and you're going to have Spire. Go into that. You're going to need a proxy host. This is the one I use. I mean, it works. Um, the proxy host, if it lets me do it, type in https colon slash slash siri dot word jelly dot com colon four 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 three. That's the proxy host that you want. That's the one that's working for me. Um, some of them don't work. I mean, Word Jelly's been working for me, so I'm gonna stick with that. I mean, um, I mean, you will have to reboot. Don't be scared to reboot. Um, that's how I was, but it did reboot and I was happy. So you're gonna get Siri. Make sure you turn it on. Go to that spire and do the proxy host like I told you to. Um, then what you're going to want to do is go in to your Safari. I don't know what this is. Yeah, I I don't know why I have Expedia on right now. But that's okay. I'll just use this page. Um exit out of that. And this is where you're going to get your um certificate. And you need this certificate for it, you know, to connect to the servers. So you can actually use Siri. I mean, some of them are all like, no, you don't need, this one doesn't need certificate. But the truth is you do. So you can get in, not like the complete kind of. Apple server, but on the other hand, it is like the Apple server. So, let's get the certificate. This is what it is Word uh, Jelly dot com um oh good sorry c a c e r t sorry i'm reading this off my computer dot p e m and you're going press go And it's going to redirect you to a download page. See, I already have it installed. That's why it's trusted. It's going to say not trusted, but that's just because it's not like an Apple thing that Apple has created. That's why it's going to say not trusted. Just go ahead and install it anyway. It's going to bring you back to this just exit it out you know and after that make sure she's on make sure you got the proxy host you're going to see you go into general and then about go down to profile 
there's the certificate that you're gonna have. World Jelly, Word Jelly Series Server. Alright, and that's how you get Siri, guys. Let's see if I can try it out on here while I'm doing a video. Sometimes it won't beep at first. Download Word Jelly, blah blah blah. Just go do it so you don't have that message anymore. All it will, all it'll give you is, if you go down here, all it'll give you, you'll download the source, and this is the only package in it. Um, once you go to here, just click reset. It won't reset your device. It'll actually just keep you on the same page. Just click reset, and then go back to settings. Um, after you have all of this installed, reboot your device again, just in case. That's what I do, so it'll work at its best. Reboot your device again, and she should work fine. I mean, you shouldn't have any problems. So that's how you get Siri, guys. If this helped you, like the video, subscribe to my channel, you know, all that good stuff. Thumbs up. Say it as your favorite so you always know. Um, if you have any questions or comments, comment down below, and I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can. Um, thanks for watching, guys, and have an awesome, spectacular night. Toodaloo!